Well, good Wednesday morning, everyone. I'm Shelly Hansel Williams, and we are out at one of my very favorite places in all of Wellington, Kansas, and that is Futures Unlimited out here on Highway North, uh, North Highway 81. And uh, we are going to talk about a new program. Kind of, it's kind of new. I better find out what's going on. Bethany Cook, the, I know you're new, Bethany, aren't you? You're, this is a new position for you. What is your official title? Work product specialist. Work product specialist. Of course, Mike Corrigan, you uh, is going on to uh, uh, more heavenly and divine things, and and so you are replacing Mike. But you've been out here at Futures for quite some time. How long have you been out with Futures? Uh, six years. Six years. Yeah. Okay. Uh, one of your, I call it a new program. But how long have you guys been offering the shred? It's program? been since February of this year. Okay, so it is fairly new then. All righty. And one of the things I'm standing by here, this big gray tub, is. Um, uh, a sh do you call it a shredded program? What's it actually called? It's document destruction. Document destruction. That sounds so much better than shredding. Shredding is just weak. But when you document destruct. Now, t I kind of learned about this firsthand, and that's kind of how this newscast came about, because um, I had called Mike about dropping off one of the tubs, and literally that's what you do. If a business or somebody calls and says, I would like one of your tubs or containers or whatever, you just drop it off? Yes. How, why don't you explain how the whole thing works? I'll let you okay. do it. Um, we drop off one of these bins over here and there's no contract so it's at your convenience. Um, you fill it up and as soon as it's full then we um, will come out, we'll pick it up and we'll give you a new one right then. So um, unlike other shredding companies, we charge you for the full bin. It's $40 for a bin. Charge you for the full bin. We come and get it um, and replace it immediately so you don't have to worry about having a bin full and not getting a new one or having a half full bin and charging for a full one. So. Exactly. And like you said, no contract. I mean, it was easy as pie. They dropped off the bin. I um, have not had to pay a dime until I actually use the thing. Right. And um, for, you know, for, for banks and a lot of companies, shredding or document dis destruction is absolutely mandatory nowadays. Yeah. And so uh, you guys are really providing a great local service. Have you found that to be the case? Yeah, and it's great because it's locally. We have that convenience of coming out um, right as soon as you call us and getting it and getting a new one in there for you. Um, and it's providing local work um, work locally. Um, and then we also send the material um, to the city to recycle when we're done. So. Oh my goodness, you just opened up all kinds of questions there. But um, <clears throat> I do want to emphasize that what exactly what Bethany just said is yes, there are Wichita companies that do this service. But when you support this program out at Futures Unlimited, you are creating local jobs and as you said you are supporting a local business by using this local shredding program and document destruction. Um, so this is what it looks like after it's destroyed. Yes, it's um, cross shredding, it's not strip shredding, so it's little tiny pieces when it's done instead of strips of pieces that could possibly get back together. Right, so. if somebody had a, yeah. <laughs> a several weeks to yeah, put it, yeah. so yeah, there's this is pretty uh, tough to figure out what is what, um, which is great for those of us, I mean, we, you know, at the chamber, we have a lot of phone numbers and things that we just don't want people to. So we, we, that's why we're using the service. But what do you call it, Mike? What is this? What is his term for this? Pulverized. Pulverized. <laughs> it's pulverized. That's a great. That's a great word. I love that. So, and uh, we're standing here in front of the. Uh, this is like a cage, but actually, it's a. It is a secure area, and it literally is secure so that the two workers that are in there are the only ones that have access then of course to the documents so yes and we um, bring the bins straight um, they're locked bins so they're locked when they're out and then we bring them straight into this cage until they're shredded and then once they're shredded um, we provide you with a certificate of destruction and then also we bill you at that time so and it's 40 bucks that's so awesome how much how much does this hold do you have any idea how many pounds or how it's 64 gallon 64 gallon huh so that's and you know um it, it's just it's so simple and of course now do do your clients back here do the workers here have to go through any special training or anything? Yeah there is a certification process so they um, get trained in not only how to use the machines but also about the confidentiality and how to protect the documents in there. 
and keep it secure. Wow, and probably how to protect themselves. It looks like uh, the machines, you don't want to get too close to them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're pretty sa safe machines, but yeah, we need to train them on how to use those too. So. All right, all right. Very, very cool. And of course, uh, this is just one of the uh, services that Futures Unlimited provides out here um, with their clients. Uh, the other clients, I think, are working. What are the other clients working on right now? Those are glasses that they're putting together right now. That's for Kansas Plastics. Oh, very cool. Like a protective eyewear? Um, they're military glasses. Military glasses. See, and Kansas Plastics, another one of our great local businesses doing something uh, that probably is going to go all over the country. And, and with the help of the clients here at Futures Unlimited, what a great way to use this workforce. Yeah, definitely. Oh, Bethany, do you just love your job? I do, I do. It's been a week, but I love it. <laughs> it's been a week. We are initiating poor Bethany by fire, but you did a wonderful job, absolutely wonderful job. So um, <clears throat> if they want to, uh, if they want to bend, how do they do that? Yeah, actually, we just got um, six new bins in yesterday, so we're ready to go. Um, and my contact number is 620-326-8906. That's Futures number. And then my extension is 255. 255 is the extension. 326-8906, the phone number out here to Futures. And, uh, of course, we're going to talk uh, uh, here in just a little bit about all the different programs. I mean, Walt, all the great stuff that uh, Futures provides. But I won't, since Bethany's only been on the job for one week, I won't put her on the spot anymore. <laughs> you did a terrific job. Thanks. Thank you. All right. We're going to take a break. We're going to come back with some happenings, some chamber stuff, all the usual right here on Wellington Today. We're back here at Futures Unlimited, and we are out. What is, Trisha Logan, of course, joins me here. Uh, she's the marketing and public relations person. And what is this? So just this is certainly your work area. That math. I, I know it's named after mm -hmm. one of my favorite people. Why don't you tell us about where we are here out at Futures? We're in the Matthew Washington Center. It's our day services building where folks who have uh, disabilities come to earn a paycheck. And we do different contracts, which we're going to tech, talk to you a little bit about here in a second. Uh, but they come here and work during the day to earn a paycheck, and then. And those who maybe need a little bit more support, they can't sustain a full work day, um, we have a day services area where we try to keep them stimulated. We have different activities and things that they uh, can do for um, those that just can't quite uh, sustain a full work day. Right. And we have a couple of the clients that are working here on the glasses that we were just talking about. Uh, tell me about this project. We got Mikey. Bump it out with me, Mikey. Mm -hmm. There we go. Bump it out. And we got Ashley, the beautiful and talented Ashley over here. There we go. Bump it out. There we go. <laughs> I, I knew you were with me. Anyway, um, two of the clients out here at Futures, and, and this is a project for who and what, and how's that work? Well, this is a contract we've been working on for quite a few years, but it's for the military, I believe. Someone, yeah, for the military. Um, Kansas Plastics, and so um, if you just, oh. Yep, they are. They're goggles, and um, we do just one part of the assembly, and I believe we send them on for the actual lenses yeah. to be put in. Um, but we've <laughs> kind of, um, we place we have just a little, um, if you can zoom in can, on yeah, the work that Ashley's doing. Ashley, can you kind of show Steve what you're working on there, sister? She's just, she's hooking uh, the strap, actually, to the top part. Um, this is kind of a finish, but, but they're hooking the strap onto the actual glasses part. That's what Ashley and Mikey and all the clients are out here doing. And uh, um, for those of you who are new to our community or don't realize, that's what Futures was created for. I mean, a group of families, including Matthew Washington and, and a bunch of uh, families here in Wellington, created Futures because their children, you know, back in the day, people just wanted to, oh, just put them in an institution or whatever. And, and these families fought for their kids because they knew they were productive, good citizens. And that's what Futures is all about. That's right. That's right. They were getting ready to, and the schools were becoming more inclusive and they were seeing so much um, success and they didn't want it to stop. They needed the kids to still be stimulated and to uh, still have uh, something meaningful to do with their lives and so they needed a service like Futures and since then we've branched on to do you know, general public transportation all of our children's programs as well right. but I wanted to point out just all the different assistive devices we're able to create we do have a workshop um, that we can create different assistive devices so if companies have just different work tasks that they need someone to kind of just do we can do one portion of that and we can come in and look and see what assistive device devices we might be able to build for them to assist them to make the process go smoother absolutely if you have some some simple task or assembly that
said, uh, your paid workers, you know, that would just be, uh, you know, a task that, that you could send here to futures. This is so much more productive, and, and I'm sure there's the cost is minimal. Mm -hmm. It probably will be more effective, um, you know, more cost effective right, for them to right, have us right, do it. Right. Well, and, I, and you have a lot of clients out here, and now, you know, we talked about it was kids, and now these are all working adults that are uh, just making such a great contribution to our, our community. Tricia, uh, tell me quickly, Walt still running? Still running, 8.30 to 8.30, Monday through Friday, 9 to 2 on Saturdays, 326-9996. Great. So general public transportation for anyone. Um, we have some um, car seats available, so if we need some of the kids that need a five-point harness, we have um, buses with five-point harnesses. Okay. Well, there you go. Uh, lots of things you guys do out at, here at Futures, uh, including the well child checks. I mean, we could probably do an hour-long show on all the services Future provides. Maybe next week. Maybe next week. <laughs> all right. Well, I'm going to let you off the hook now, Tricia. I've got to talk about the rest of the stuff, so I'll, thank you, dear. And. Uh, <laughs> All right, we're back out here at Futures Unlimited in the Matthew Washington, what is it called? Production Center? Or? Matthew Washington Center. Center. <laughs> it's just center. I'm Production Center. I'm. It is where that's happening out here at Futures Unlimited. The be beautiful and talented Ashley here to my right. Here, Ashley, you got to show that smile to the camera. Show that smile to the camera. There we go. <laughs> that is awesome. So that's what I've uh, had to, to look at all morning, and I've it made, I don't, there's no way you can not be happy. Mikey! Mikey's giving the crowd. I love you. I love you, my people. I love you. Is that for your sister, Patty? Is that for Patty? Yes. Was that for Patty? Absolutely. All right. Very good. We know that Patty and Mikey are, are uh, fans and watchers of Channel 55 and our newscast, so we do love you, Patty. All righty. There you go. All right. Well, um, Bethany is back here, and, and you're one week on the job, but actually six years here at Futures, and um, we're just, uh, you guys have got a great place out here, and uh, is there anything else you'd like to tell folks about this wonderful place that you get to work at every day? Um, well, as far as our document destruction, just give me a call. We also um, have, if you have like personal documents that you want destroyed and you mm -hmm. don't want a big bin, you can bring them up to the front and we'll just charge you that way too. So. Oh, that's right. As a matter of fact, uh, when we were talking about the document destruction earlier, uh, you're absolutely right. Maybe you're not one who goes through how many gallons? 64. 64 gallons of shredded need, uh, stuff that needs shredded. Uh, if you just have a box at home, yep. and how do you charge on that? How do you do that? It depends on the size of the box. Usually we go from like a small, like a shoebox size is a dollar up to the biggest you can carry in, which would be five dollars. Oh my goodness, that's so affordable, so cheap, and uh, uh, so good, uh, great service. And then they can just bring it right to the main office there? Right to the front door. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. There you have it, document destruction. And that's such a very powerful thing. Uh, out here at Futures Unlimited, and we've got our two uh, certified document destructors behind me. Yeah, they are certified. <laughs> they, are, they really are. I'm not, but that's not a joke. They really are certified. And uh, very secure, as you can see, the authorized person's air restricted area. Uh, so if you are worried that this is not confidential, uh, I think you guys go above and beyond to make sure that people's documents are secure and taken care of. Yeah, and if um, you have any concerns about it, you're welcome to come out here and watch while we destroy your documents. You can do that every time. You can schedule an appointment, or you can come out the first time, schedule an appointment, and watch while we destroy them. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, that is awesome. Good idea. All right. Well, I am a big fan of everything that Futures does out here. Of course, uh, as we talked with Tricia as well, if uh, if there's any kind of service or product or something that uh, the Futures clients could help you, maybe a symbol like Ashley and Mikey are doing here with these glasses that Kansas Plastics uh, sends to the military. Um, they are they are great, great workforce out here and very, very productive group. Right, guys and gals? Woohoo! Woohoo! Yeah! I, I love my group out here. I know, you guys are awesome. We hope that you have enjoyed uh, learning a little bit more about this wonderful, wonderful place that we call Futures Unlimited right here in Wellington, America, uh, making a difference not only in these clients' lives, but making a huge difference in our community, always looking for ways to better our community. We were we were talking about that as we were walking out, actually, Tricia and I, and uh, one of uh, the titles here is Community Supporter. I think that should be behind everyone who works out here. Yeah, I agree.
agree. You absolutely are great community supporters. So thank you to Futures and Limited and all the clients and the girl who's been on the job for one week who did a great job. Give me a high five right there. All right. Thank you, Ashley. You did a super job. Mikey, you the man. I know it. <laughs> all right. Thank you, guys. We we'll love you. We're going to wrap it up for Futures Unlimited, but uh, we will not, we, it is not a finished newscast unless we say because of clients and great companies like Futures Unlimited and all the wonderful local services and things that they provide and the new gal, Bethany, we can say to live well is to live Wellington. Have a great rest of the week.